Hey everybody, thanks for watching A Guy Doing Stuff. Like most woodworkers, I know applying a finish is usually my least favorite part of any of the projects I do. Um, this is my first time I've ever used true oil, and so far I'm really happy with it. I wasn't even going to post a video about this, um, but it's going so well so far, and it's been a while since I posted a video to YouTube that I figured I might as well film it. This is the guitar so far. I'm seven coats in, and I have about seven left till I'm done. I'm following some directions I found online from Eric Schaefer. I'll put a link to those in my video description. The most common finish you usually see on an acoustic guitar is a spray-on lacquer. There's a couple reasons I chose not to do that and uh, went with a true oil rub-on finish instead, but mostly just because I hate spraying things. Um, the setup I have right now is I'm hanging the guitar from the ceiling. I've taped off the fretboard and the bridge because um, you don't finish those with um, a traditional finish. And then I'm also, my lighting setup, I have two of these giant softbox lights um, that I use to inspect the piece as I'm working on it. I hold it up to the light so I can see all the glares and act what I'm actually working with. I started finishing a couple days ago by using this water based pore filler called Aqua Coat. I rubbed this on, waited about an hour, then sanded back to bare wood with 220 grit, and I did two coats of that before I started with the True Oil. Here's some footage from the first coat of True Oil. I've just kind of been rubbing it on in super, super thin coats, and every one I've added has made it look way better, so I'm excited to see what it looks like when it's, when it's all done. To apply it, I wrap a little piece of an old white t-shirt and a coffee filter, put a tiny bit of oil on it, and then I pretty much just rub the surface of the wood down really hard. Every once in a while I add a little bit of oil to the coffee filter thing too. I start with the front, then I do the back, then I do the sides, and notice I'm holding it by the neck this whole time. And after the body is done, I do the heel, jump to the head, then I hold it by the taped fretboard like this while I rub uh, the rest of the neck. I'll do about six more coats like this, then I think I'm going to try to do some kind of matte finish by rubbing it down with steel wool dipped in uh, wax paste, but um, I need to do more reading before I decide exactly what I'm going to do for the final coats. So far I'm really happy with how easy it's been and how good it looks, but this is my first time so I'll let you guys know how it actually turns out in the end. Once the guitar's all the way done, I will uh, post a video on here of somebody playing it so you guys can hear how it actually sounds. I am going to be starting the instructional series for my second guitar um, here really soon after I finish this one, so feel free to subscribe if you're interested in seeing that. Feel free to leave comments on this video with any questions you guys have, and uh, thank you for watching.